Welcome, dear viewer, to the best thing since we the best thing since sliced bread. Let's pay the place a visit and take it offline. Welcome to PTV. I am your host with the most uh, hot like buttered toast, shining bright like a lamppost. The P to the Y to the R to the O. It's your boy Pyro, and it's hammer time. We're here with Stretchy Girl and Iron Guy, and because our good friend uh, Tiger Astra slash Asta slash Filth Withers likes Black Widow, Black Widow is coming along on the journey for some shooty fun. And uh, I have to defeat some elite hives. So today, God of Thunder versus the elite. The elite. The, the elite. Speaking of the elite, if you haven't seen this week's AEW Wrestling and you're a wrestling your fan, I highly recommend watching it. This is one of AIM's and security if you're watching this in the future and it's not this week anymore, how good was that Winter is Coming episode of AEW Dynamite? Ruddy fantastic. The forbidden, the forbidden gate has been opened, and I'm stumbling over mouth words. Okay. The elite hives entry terminal on your HUD. That you have, Robot Butler. That you have. Let us go. Away. Last few days have been fun and productive days. There's a giant robot. Uh, of, of recording of, of all sorts uh, between having a musical boogie uh, and freestyling tunes with, with friends uh, to recording an, uh, an interview for the uh, Tangent Off Topic podcast with other good friends across the globe! Uh, friends that uh, once we're ready to do so and Square Enix pull their thumb out their butts and give us some new content uh, will be up for joining us for uh, for PTV, but we are waiting for the arrival of Hawkeye before we get into the Avengers Initiative project. But luckily for us, until then, uh, we are still in pursuit of the ever elusive 100% uh, for the Campagan or War Tablet. An so. We shall continue to bash and smash our way through the Avengers post-campaign until either we get the elusive 100% completion rate on the Compagnon War Tablet, or until Square Enix uh, sorts their lives out and gives us this shiny new content that they've been promising for ever and a day. And uh, we have Hawkeye to, to, to play with as well. So, that's, that's what's going on there. Um, in other news, uh, I've also been uh, recording some, some rather nice new musical doot doot rhyming mouth words with uh, one Wayne Miller and with the help of... Uh, uh, what was the guy's name again? Uh, Tr Trey Candlestick Maker? Uh, Trent Butcher. No. Uh, uh, it'll come to me eventually. Um, yes, yeah, so we've been working on some, some musical doot doots. Uh, I laid down the main vocals, uh, said them over, and it's coming together nicely. And tomorrow, uh, either before or after I record Fairy Tale Friday, I'll be recording. Recording? I'll be recording the, uh, the hypes and the, uh, the harmonies, is what I'll be recording. Do you like dags? Ah, oh, dogs. I like caravans better. Yes. Uh, new new tune called Witch Me. It's, it's in the pipeline and it's on its way. Uh, how long it'll take to finish, I don't know. It's a question of how long's a piece of string. There have been uh, technical issues. Technical issues that I wish I could solve by um, raising my hammer and electrocuting my computer. But uh, not everything's as cushy as it is when you're a god of thunder. Sometimes you just have to uh, accept the the falls of a mortal man and make the most of the cards you're dealt and stuff. P -p poker face. P -p poker face. Be gone, little robot. Uh, 
Excuse you. I don't recall giving you permission to uh, be such a problem. So today, as you can see, uh, the, the task at hand is to complete this elite hive. I don't know what it makes it elite and more of a hive than a normal hive, but uh, hives are a problem that must be dealt with post haste. So we have six floors to complete. Uh, currently on floor one. Let's see what goodies lie behind this door. Oh, heavens to Betsy! Small robots. These enemies must be defeated. Is that all? Defeat the robots, you say? What what task could be simpler? Excuse you. I'll do you a fuck. Crab robot. Crab robot. Crab robot. Looks like crab. Dies like robots. Excuse me, Mr. Crab Robot. You've been uh, thunderstruck. Oh, goody. Bang, 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 die. No. Oh, another crab robot! Looks like crab dies like robot. Gotta get around the front so I can do it. No. They stole my glory! How very dare. Oh well. Off we toddle. Yes, this is what I wish I could do to technology. Just raise my hammer, charge it with some lightning, and make it work. But unfortunately, I've had no such luck, and... Uh, I don't feel like complaining about it much more, because it feels like the most first-world problem in the world. Oh dear, I've got this awesome technology that you know, I can't you, use. None of this would have happened. Cap would still be lost. Bruce yes, Tony you're quite right. I am magnificent. Really uh oh, you I meant Thundergirl. Stretchy. The to cut you down just fine. You don't need to help it. you got the Avengers back together. Be proud. Yes, be proud, stretchy girl. If you can gain control of AIM's network temporarily, I can infiltrate their security system. AIM will attempt to initiate a shutdown protocol if they gain access to the terminal. Yes. You tell me what to do, Robert Butler. You're not my real father. That helps. Thank you. The shutdown protocol is progressing. Anthony Hopkins is my real father. Aim is trying to remove me from their system. Yes, that's, that's problematic. I, I agree. I'm inside Aim security system. What have I told you about putting yourself inside strange robots, my office? It's unhygienic. You don't know where it's been. This is last one. No problem. Excuse you. Beginning infiltration. How? What are these things? I don't feel like this is any different from the last time we did a hive. I mean, the game insists, verily, that it is different. But... 
for this exact moment, I'm failing to see how. And I'm one of the loyal players. I've been playing this for months since release day with, I mean, some complaints, but the complaints seemed uh, like they were justified because, you know, you could turn the camera to the right and there were other game-breaking glitches that I found that would rather hilarious if I look back at it fondly in hindsight, but at the time it was god damn annoying! Look at all these robots. Beginning infiltration. Uh, bother. Hey, I've been caught by a vortex. Physics be damned. Excuse you very much. Beginning infiltration. There we go. And now all the robots just run away like a bunch of cats. Is that a purple thingy down there? What's a purple thingy? Thank you for the purple thingy. Turns out it's rubbish, but thank you for the purple thingy. I'll be sure to dismantle it immediately and turn it into gubbins. Not too immediately, because apparently that cancels out the loading of the lift. Once the lift's gotten going... Is not surprising given its main purpose. Yes, you keep rambling on, Jarvis, and I'm going to uh, press some buttons. You're rubbish. You're rubbish. Nothing there. Rubbish. Rubbish. Uh, you, you might be good. So, anyone want to get a shawarma after we're done dealing with hives? It's quite delicious. Has a server bank nearby. Cheers, bot! That's from the song. Remember the song? That was the line in the, in the beta. Did they feel that that line was too on the nose and that's why they trimmed it to just who you're going to call Hulk Buster? These are the questions we need to have answers to. Like, not immediately, but soon. It's hammer time. Oh, I've been jabbering away and I've already made it through three of these floors. How time flies when you're having fun smashing up more robots! They will throw everything at you to keep their servers intact. Yes, well I'll throw a hammer at the server to make sure they're not intact. See how that works? It's bloody marvelous. Up you go. Back you come. Smack, smack. Do one. Then up you go and try! Well, what else can I say about this game? I mean, yes, it's it gets a bit same. Yes, it's a bit repetitive at times. But uh, I still love it so. No. I don't like being choked by jizz bots against my will, though. So I'll, I'm going to leave that situation. Excuse you. Thank you, thank you. You're far too kind. Um, no, that's 
that's not what I want to do. What I want to do is stand back here, where it's less dangerous, and some might say that's cowardly, but I say work smarter, not harder. Choke you to death! To die! Excuse you very much! Dare you! Choke slam a lady! Top gamer tip, never choke slam a lady without her permission. More of a top life tip, I don't know. Fry the computer, make it work. Off we talk. Now we go to uh, floor Thor. Huh? Huh? Floor four? Four, four, floor four. Is the older heavy? I mean, if you can pick it up. Uh, it is a different kind of weight to wield. Cool. It's as heavy as the burden of being a god of thunder who is charged with looking after you mere little mortals. I mean, some of you have superpowers, sure, like you, stretchy girl, with the lightning bolt on your tummy. But then some mortals, <coughs> some mortals, don't have any powers at all, and really, they're just a burden. I mean, at least Iron Guy has the, the common sense to hide in a suit of armor. Black Widow, she's just like, I'm a chick with guns. That's my power. Deal with it. Okay, guess I'll find some switches. Then switch. It's like... I just love the episode of the Avengers where Thor ran around looking for switches to open a door. I've heard the windows are the new doors. Might just be a rumor. A rumor of an ugly future in which... Hold the phone. You. Iron Man. Open that door for me. Iron Man. Door. Double whammy! Iron Man! Get off of the floor! Open the door! Potato. You better have opened that door. Shoot, potato. Excuse me. Three potato. Uh, a four. Gripping action. Like, comment, and subscribe if you're blown away by the door opening action. Oh, we did open the door. Double door action. Thanks, Avengers. That did you're it. most the welcome, your tiny way. human. You're safe now. Yeah. Look, I'm, I'm just trying to get some treasure. I'm just here for the booty, you might say. Yes, I do, but. Sturges, but. Consider yourself defeated. 
Anything better in this golden box? Nope. Just more tat. Well, fairly well. I'm, I'm, I'm engaging enemies. I'm, oh, more treasure. Fine, I'll get the third treasure. But I'm not going to... I'm not going to engage with you. You're not worth my time. Oh. How convenient. Door. The door on the fourth floor for Thor to open. Are there any more? I'm not sure. Sick rhyming freestyles. Stand on the big A. Ah. You say it's the last one, but it says there's at least two more. But... If we complete this These in good time, uh, I might treat you all to a bonus Taskmaster yeeting. What are we trying to complete here? Defeat all targets. Oh, well, alright. You're dead now. Flying through the sky, fighting robots. It's a tough life, but someone's got to live it. I didn't choose the Thor life, the Thor life chose me. Oh, I hope you're all thoroughly enjoying your Thursday nights as I bounce around merrily and zap robots with my magical lightning hammer. Bringing you a, your weekly dose of Thursday Night Thunder. Some kind of rubbish going on over here. You there! How about me? Did I just raise a robot with my... No, he's still on the ground. Giant robot! Meet Bifrost. Dead. Another giant robot? I, I saw another giant robot. Where did he go? Mr. Ribbits? Hello? Where is that light? Are you a thing? Like, is this little electrical spark ball in the ceiling what makes this elite? Uh, robots? Robots. Robots. No, you're not a robot, you're just a man. Now you're dead. I mean, it's still fucking shooting! Look at it! Someone tell Tesla the coolest tits. Call Elon Musk. He deals with stuff like that. Oh, four down, two to go. What else can we uh, talk about whilst we're here spending quality time together on a Thursday, maybe? Depending on when you uh, watch this video and view it. It's up to you. I mean, it's your life. You're a grown adult. I'm not going to tell you what to watch, when to watch it. I mean, if you come by the channel on a Thursday night and watch Thursday Night Thunder and you're kind enough to like and subscribe and even share with your friends, up that thumb, smash that bell, it's rather good of you. But if you don't, you know, I, I won't hold it against you. I still love you as a merciful god of thunder. A fair and benevolent ruler. These enemies must be defeated. So, I'm not saying you have to do it. I'm just saying I'll be gravely disappointed if you don't. No pressure. Ah, a joke, a joke. I kid, a kid, of course. A jest, good friends. It's all in good fun. <laughs> We're all friends here. Little jerk flying around trying to blow me up. I mean, honestly. 
What's his problem? This guy with his gun is like, oh, I'm going to shoot you. Is that as far as your personality extends? I am man with gun. You've got about as much personality as girl with horse. So that's the extent of your personality. Swipe left. My dating app, Pog. Plenty of gods. Norsk, Greek, Roman, Hindi. All the gods. God damn it. You're a fiery jizz boss. You should probably see a doctor about your condition. Have a choking. That didn't do the trick. Open the Bifrost. Close the Bifrost. Oh, he moved. Oh, he moved because he's dead. Oh, there are more fiery jizzbits. Ruddy fantastic. Oh, you're dead. Bring the hammer down. Shatter your spine. Shit your guts out and die. I smacked the jizz out of you. If anyone out there can tell me why those weird one-eyed robots are filled with jizz. Oh, they're one-eyed monsters. I, I've already answered the question. But if you have another theory as to why those one-eyed monsters are filled with jizz, um, leave a comment below. The are concentrated on the final floor. Be ready. They represent the pinnacle of AIM Synthoid technology. Right. So what you're saying is we should fly up in there, smash them, and be done with it. At least I feel like that's what you're saying. An elite AIM team is close by and on alert. Okay. Updating your HUD. Hello. Consider yourself updated. Oh, he's choking me. Release me at once. Hey, you're dead. You're, uh, you've all been defeated. See you later. Oh, what other splendid wonders might possibly lie ahead? I fair to wager, it's more robots. It's always more robots. You're dead. Oh no, another one. Who'd have thunk it, David Blunkett? Yeah. Don't mind me, just getting some uh, nice health spheres. That's right, I, I might be a god, but I still need the NHS. Hashtag, don't sell the NHS. Further hashtag, get one of those in America. Universal healthcare is a great idea! He dead now? I'm gonna say yes. Oh, look. Even more robots. Ah, these are the elite you have warned me about. Defeat the elite! Your annoyance. Your annoyance. 
You're an annoyance. All right. That's that dealt with. Choked him and then he exploded with jits. Yes, that's right. Nothing suspect about that at all. One of their agents is down. NHS, save me! Thunderstruck! Stop! Huh. Hammer time! If it's not broke, don't fix it. Run with those classics. Uh, one, two more. Here are Jisbet. No further help for you, my friend. It's rude. Frankly inconsiderate. Die. Oh, heavens to Betsy. Yet another Jismet. Die. I don't think they ever were a threat for Robert Butler. They've been dealt with thoroughly and sent to, um, well, not Valhalla. They were a bunch of cats. Um, where do people who aren't good go when they die? What's, what's the equivalent? Uh, Hella? No, she's my sister that tears things apart. Maybe just hell. <coughs> She's increased security in all aim bases and is using her massive war bots Rin to defend her Rin secret. of the Nibelung. Nibelung. Big. Something I've... that could turn the tide in AIM's favor. I found some godly bling. We've accomplished in the fight against AIM so far. We've got top agents working on the situation now. Good work. All right. I will stay Thank you. For any new elite hives that appear. Good, good job. What does this do? Uh, increases amount of restored by orbs. Uh -huh. Chance of defeating enemies will produce random orb. Boost to unlock. Blah, blah, blah. Intrinsic orbs and heroic. That might be useful. But, uh... I'm tempted to see if we have enough time to defeat a taskmaster. The only problem, and, and it's, it's, a, it's a minor problem at best, is I don't know what time I started this fun and games romp of smashing robots. And I don't know if I have time um, to do the thing I want to do. I could just play it safe, or hear me out here I could go against every instinct I have as a gamer do the mission with taskmaster and yeet him off of the roof but just do the main run of the mission ignoring all the side stuff because I need to defeat a dreadbot with a takedown and I need to defeat an adaptoid whilst unarmed so oh I'm feeling lucky punk let's do it let's let's go for it let's This will either be perfect or it'll go horribly wrong. But here we go. Straight in. Uh, but in order to yeet Taskmaster off of a roof, we have to bid farewell to Thor and say hello to Mr. Hulk. Lunch mission immediately. We're going to peg it, we're going to smash, we're going to get to the Taskmaster, we're going to yeet him the off the roof. Of it's going to be beautiful. Yep, I hear you, Pim. Goal is to create an army of our worst I bet enemies. it is. I'm sure you'll agree that we can't let that happen. 
We need to take down whatever foe she's totally resurrected, agree. or we'll be faced with a daunting problem. Uh -huh, can I count uh -huh, on your uh -huh. help? You can count on me. Let's get a freaking move on, though. Because in my head, I feel like that hive took about half an hour, about five minutes, floor, six floors. So there should be time for this. If there's not, I ran over, so therefore you didn't hear the intro. So let's have another intro here towards the end of the episode, basically saying what I would have said then if it didn't cut cut off. And if it didn't cut it off, and it is all there, then I'm just being twice as nice We're to you. But welcome to PTV, the, the best thing since the best thing since Aim sliced bread. Uh, I'm your host with the most hot light butter toast, the P to the Y to the R to the O. Uh, the pudding is in the proof, and we are going to yeet Taskmaster off of a roof. Ignoring and foregoing all side missions just so that we can end on a little slice of hilarity. Away! You're gonna have to take them out before you can enter the facility. You're just sure and a distraction. You guys have to die, but that's not too much of a problem. Land in the middle and give them all a slap. And smack them up. Choke slam! He's my friend from work. Yes, yes, I hate oh, you. Man, this hurts. Didn't throw him far enough. <laughs> oh, be gone. One of their agents is down. That was a little uh, sneak peek at the, at the at the main event. Now I'll give you the clap. Excellent. Down. Another enemy defeated. See how much quicker it is to just yeet people into a river. You, you seem to have gone. Problem solved. We're scanning the facility for the clone's location. In the meantime, I'm sending you to the lower floors to find a target who has more information. Don't bother me with the details. Just let's crack on with it. Hulk in hurry. Birds. Hulk in rush. Hulk hit tiny computer. Hulk maybe swatched classic colors during lift so that people can admire him in classic green. Because as much as Pyro like Grey Hulk, people do not familiar with comic books be like, why Hulk Grey? And short answer is because Hulk was originally Grey, and then it was like, hmm, that's pretty cool. So they brought back Grey Hulk later as other type of Hulk that is slightly smarter and faster but not quite as strong. But let's not bog you down with the details and let's just be classic Green Hulk. There he is with his nice purple trunks and his torn ripped t-shirt. Yeah! Happy days! <coughs> Hulk give in to stereotype and be with gear what people by. want him to be. Green smashy monster. There's a security but really, chief up Hulk ahead deep, who has the information like for the facility. Bottomless you know lake. Not shallow like Puddle and Tony Stark. 
get down here, Jizzbot. I ain't got time for whatever you're off. You're like, oh, I've got rocks around me and psychic powers and whatnot. Well, I'm a Hulk. And then, when you're all tiny, I'm going to just grab you. No. <laughs> yeah! Whip him about. Whip it good. Die. Everyone dead. Everyone dead. Not everyone dead. More dead. Die. Die. Bad. Bad. Robot. Go away. We're not, we're not here for whatever you got. No time for encyclopedias. Ah, oh, this guy. Ah, oh, crab robot. available in smaller bite-sized chunks. No time for quips, Black Widow. Also, no time for lullabies. Don't sing to Hulk and make me drowsy. Excuse? Robot. It doesn't matter. It's dead. Oh, thank you. Thanks, Robot Man. But Hulk not need compliments. Hulk need to hurry to boss so can yeet off roof and end video in comical style. Because personally, shrinking bosses that are meant to take several minutes to fight and then just launching them off of a roof brings me great joy and amusement. And if you don't like it, I don't like you. Like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy boss yeetage. Using his credentials we made it into the aim database and together we made it we, we made it even though we had our back up against the walls floor. forever we made it and yeah that's that's as much as so that as I can quote right now come. a shame you won't be around long glad we're on the same page about your chances all righty credentials to enter the aim database and we have look into the room on the top floor watch out I think it might be expected. Make Taskmaster tiny. Stage one complete. Get him shook. No, stop moving him. Oh, now he's big again. Sure do wish they haven't patched this and what I'm trying to do is now no longer feasible. That would suck. There he is. Going. Oh, that might not have been Taskmaster. Uh, no, I don't think that was Taskmaster. That was one of the Warhounds! Is he gone? He's gone. 
There he is. There we go, got ya. Bye, boss boy. Ah, oh, you grew, you son of a bitch. I will defeat you in the manner that I want to defeat you. I won't be stopped by semantics and game physics. Do it, put you back into it. Why won't you shrink? Ah, hook down. Come on, shrink. A little bastard. Ah, oh, we vanished. I might actually have to defeat this guy the hard way. Which makes me sad, but you know, what can you do? You, eat you off the roof instead. Yeet! Problem solved! Data, bitch! And that's it for this week on PTV, and I'll be back tomorrow with Fairy Tale Fridays. So until then, I love you all, and there's not a goddamn thing you can do about it. Peace out for now, and later, bitches! Hulk out.